Warning, the following video contains a beard gone afro crazy. This should not be attempted by young aspiring beard warriors. Always seek professional barber assistance. Hey you two, this is it, early morning, I'm going to vlog the whole day today, just because I want to, and somebody, I, because I want to tell you what real life's like, you know what real life's like, I was up till 4 in the morning last night, because, yeah, yeah because I had to stay up to do um, orders and be online with the USA and things like that, so I was up, and at half 3 in the morning, or maybe quarter to 4, somebody there, Decided it'd be really fun to shit all on the floor in the kitchen. We found out this morning she got an upset stomach, so we can't really blame her. Although um, who do we blame? I blame McDonald's I blame, and the French. I blame as Lex always. For when Roxy ran out of dog food, I'm having to keep this camera her, slightly he, high because it gets a bit pornographic down here he, in the morning. He I'm gonna do this. I'll film like this. <laughs> he fed Roxy our two-year-old pug. So, <laughs> you said Roxy, your two year old pup, left over chow mein. Well, it was better than nothing, and I put yeah. bran and oats in it. Yeah. I will so, there was a knocking at the door this morning yeah. that I remember being poked in the ribs about, but couldn't go because I was in my birthday suit. He was naked. <laughs> so, unless the postman wanted a really nice morning surprise. But I was fully you clothed. Fully clothed. So, she went down and check it out. Inspired by our stay with Christian and Nikki in Texas, who had one of these bad boys, we've got ourselves a hot plate. Awesome. So this thing basically heats up. You put a locale spray on it and you can cook chicken, eggs, bacon. They heat up like insta-fast. So... And guess what? They gave us two of the little things, so one breaks and then spare. This is this is the, the hot plate here. You, you set here the heat and whatnot. But this, it, I mean, I can't tell you how quick it gets hot. It gets hot really fast. Then here you can see there's a little hole. So you scrape all everything down there using one of these silicon. Um, well, what do you what do you call them? Because it's actually a teriyaki pan. So ah. it's meant to be for like you know doing Japanese food. Huh? But like so they gave us that. Anyway, we're going to be using a silicon. You can one, use just one of these spatulas. Where are they? One of the, yeah, there you go. Silicon spatula. One of these. So you would use one of these because these are fantastic. And you just would scrape everything off. And it goes into the drip tray. So super fast, super easy. And makes eggs in minute, minutes. Ah, oh, puppy. puppy behind me. Okay, so, but look. Where's the egg basket? Oh, there it is. Our egg basket is empty. So I'm going to take Stinker to get some eggs. She told some of the sounds. Rox. Rox, want to get some eggs? Should we go get some eggs? Want to get some eggs? Come on then. <coughs> wow. Do you love, do you love cardio? Do you love cardio? Yeah. So as you can see, she's a highly trained lead dog. She doesn't pull at all. Idiot. <laughs> anyway, back up. So, if you haven't watched um, any of our videos that I did with August whilst he was here, then why the hell not? Get on the playlist. It's called um, Road Trip UK Side. Check it out. But if you haven't seen it, this is where I live. Lovely little country road. Cool. And look. There you go. Brandon, I got a really nice Cantonese restaurant in my street, which is actually very good, owned by a former school friend of ours. Then we have fields and trees, and that right there, people, that house you see is a farm. And in that bad boy farm is eggs. Pretty much, you can see all of what is just down the road. It's like a minute walk. This is where we get eggs from. Free range, fresh every morning, and there's a little trust book, uh, trust box that they put out. So nobody monitors you; they just put the eggs out in a uh, in a box, and you put the money in. It's like that's where where I live and how nice it is where I live. And this is why I don't live in the city because you put a box of eggs out in the city, people would steal those eggs 
to come back to where they sold them from and egg your house. <laughs> there you go. Free range eggs available now. And you're literally rocking through the gates of the farm. Stinking on the ground. Come on, trouble. Sheep, yeah, you tell them, mate. You go literally see it on the farm. Farmer working there. You can see him. Hope he's not going to be videoed. There you go. And then some chickens. Standard behaviour on the farm. And then here you go. There's a re range dog. And there's the eggs. This is the recycle bin. So you literally put all your cups you brought back there. And there's the box of eggs. There you are. And then there's a little trust box with the coins and all the eggs. Okay, well, so morning ritual. We're just talking about how this jet lag's kicking our ass. I got some uh, some super greens, multi bit, vitamin C, and creatine. I'm gonna put it in here, and then this is my Pro Mix. Which has lid here, so it looks like that when complete. And these are wicked because you put stuff in and then boom. Mixes it for you. Great for creating, because creating always sinks to the bottom. And this is just a cherries and berries sugar free juice. See you ladies up on the plate already. See it. And that was you literally turned that on like a minute ago, yeah? Yes. Amazing, amazing. Okay, let's mix this up. Concoction mixed up with the super greens, five grams of creatine, and the sugar-free juice. Put the mixer on there. Just let it go in there. That's all mixing nicely. And Lainey's already off here. It's literally a minute later. Put the bacon on there and look how all the fat is coming off. Everything that's in there just comes straight off. Look at that. Sweet. In there, I'm gonna pop one of these. In it. Two, there we go, we're done. That's that ever vesting. The base. Super green creatine vitamin shake, you're ready to go. Mm. Yep, yep, yep. So we're going on one awesome Laney Fuel the Sandwich. Thank you, baby. You're welcome. Look at that. Oh, food porn. And that, folks, is breakfast. Okay, so this is what my morning consisted of. Getting through all the emails. And now, I got to go and grab some... Uh, <laughs> hey, that vest looks good. Yeah, I know. Gotta go grab some, I'll um, start removing premises. So in the interim, we are um, kind of storing stock in any way we can. <laughs> Whilst we're moving it all around, just finalised all the new stuff coming through from um, for the new lines for the boombabyclothing.com. Check it out. That should be here in the next top five days. Full restock, new lines, awesome shit, man. Yep, yep. Okay, onward with the day. Check out my beard. Got a tash. I'm speaking to curl, man. Beard is rocking it! Boom, baby! Man, Lex Fitness. That code at UK site is getting hella busy. Yeah, dailies, dailies. Coming in so much. There's so many people messaging me. Uh, trying to get through it all. And uh, as well as everything else going on. It's a good one. Busy time, but the sun's come out a little bit. It's nice again. And check it out. Little lady shouts me down. This is what she does on our new griddle again. She's just been cooking random things just to use it, huh? Literally. <laughs> no, she's all made up. Me filming her when she's actually... I've got makeup and clothes on. <laughs> it's a and stop filming all the time. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so check it out, guys. So you can see that new high def camera being used for food porn. So what is this, babe? Bacon medallions, mm -hmm. brie cheese, 
Brie, low fat Brie. Low fat Brie. Sick. And. Say the low fat Brie. Bread. And. Is it in the base here? Yeah. Uh, is it? One egg, one egg question. So you can see fat reduced Brie. So protein 20.5, carbs pretty much zero. And fat is only 16 per 100. Per 100, 16 fat, man. 16 for cheese. This is what I mean, you can eat what you want. There are variations out there, you've just got to find them if you live in the UK. American people just go to your nearest garage or gas station, they'll probably sell it. Not like you. <laughs> um, other than that, we are going to go mail out some stuff. And Slave labor, now I understand. Slave labor in. And all orders and things get us shipped out and well that's all we're doing we are training with gareth, training with gareth and catherine and we're going to take the camera and we get some film with gareth because he is now 38 days out from the show he wants to do and catherine, and catherine is looking so good on my diet and what catherine is looking so good on my diet that now she was just doing it to look good and now she's like even on my gym keep on asking if i'm competing so, I'm going to look at her today and see where she's at to do the show. Do the show. So, now I'll have like, three clients who are doing shows. Sick. So, we've got Nikki, Nikki Blackhunter, everyone knows Nikki. Then, I've got Catherine Bann, who will be our first show. And then I've got another girl as well, who I'm going to be doing some posing with. Yeah, we've got a, a girl coming all the way from Sussex, is it? Yeah. Sussex and flying over to do some posing with Lainey for figure. No, yeah, figure? Yeah, figure. Yeah, figure. Yeah, figure. Yeah, figure. Yeah, figure. Yeah, figure. Check it out, rocking my CG with my boom baby. Um, what else are we doing? So we're training with Gareth and Catherine. Yeah, Catherine, uh, Catherine, Catherine thinking of doing a show coming in. Gareth actually is in a diet now, doing uh, Shred. He's the guy who you will have seen before. If you haven't seen him before, he competed in an unnatural show. He was still natty, but it was just the closest thing we had to put him in. And with it being just a qualifying show for the Britain, it was probably uh, it was a reasonable thought to put him in there. In did we put him in novice or first, first timers? I think we put him in first times. Anyway, the class wasn't too big, it turned out to be okay. And we actually ended up winning um, his entire class and he went through to the overall of it. He didn't obviously didn't win an overall in a non natty show, but if you haven't seen it, I'll link the video here. Click it! You'll like it, it's good times. If you like seeing men rubbing tiny into other men's buttocks. Come on, you're at home alone, no one's gonna judge you. <laughs> and other than that, okay. So onward, jobs. Eat that sandwich. Where's it gone? No sandwich. Eat that. And then training. Nuh uh. This is my sandwich. You can't have none. You can't have none of my sandwich. No. It's mine. Why did you do a poop on the floor? What is that on your face? Because Gary and Catherine get up at 7 o'clock and you want to get up at 11 and I can't hold my poops in that now. Rocks. You hold your poops in. No? Mmm. Just Mmm. You see that? Difference between me and you? Posable thumbs. Okay. Finish my sandwich and I'm going to follow it up with my favourite. What was that? The weirdo. Me trying to change the camera. There. Weight Watchers. And this one of my favourites is this one. Yep. Two of those. 5.6 protein, 5.6 carbs in both. So, 11 protein, 11 carb, and look at all fat. And that was straight after the sandwich. Look at my sandwich! Because I was a fatty on holidays, I'm not allowed to eat the same food as X for a while. So, I get sandwich thins, which are 20 grams carbs. I get mm, scrambled egg whites with some red onion and tomato. Sorry, I forgot to put that in yours. And uh, some lean ham. You forgot to put what in mine? Uh, tomatoes and onions. Right, doesn't matter. Mine's good. And then uh, some a uh, slice of milky low fat cheese. So you got low fat cheese, ham, red onion, tomato, and egg white. Yeah? And I'd like to point out that Lex dropped <laughs> some of his sandwich <laughs> on the ground outside. <laughs> Not in the kitchen, outside, and like where no five second rule applies because it's outside where Roxy wheeze, walks. She does not wee out there anymore. She, she does on occasion, Lex. No. And it rained yesterday anyway. Uh, yeah, he picked up the egg and ate it. Not even sorry. I forgot to mention because I'm such a snacker and the fact that Lainey just keeps feeding me. Um, we have eaten one of these as well. 
Um, can you see that? What? Where's the name of it? There you go. There you go. Uh, pure protein. Um, chocolate deluxe. There you go. And it, what it is? They like 20 grams of protein. What are they? Let's have a look at them. Can't She's getting cool now, man. Looking like a pirate. Arr. Yeah. You thought, man. Okay, I'd like to point out Lex is working in my little workstation. He's sitting there, taking over. That was my one protein coffee of the day, so I'm due look at this one. Look at this archaic this is, piece of Does crack. anyone want it? Like, look, actually look, look at it. Roxy ate that bit, and she that bit, are. when she was a puppy. And that is what I do on my This is how much Lainey laptop. didn't use a laptop until she started doing what we do now. So we've got to get Lainey, I think we're going to get an Apple desktop. I think that Lainey should get an Apple um, Mac, MacBook Pro. Because we need an Apple for editing the videos and stuff, but then we've got the Windows system for everything else that's user friendly. I think um, everyone wants to see me on YouTube and get rid of Lex, because Lex is a little bitch. Ah, yeah, yeah, yeah. You and your face are plans with Nikki. Yeah. That is happy too, no! Roxy is very interested in what Lex is talking about. Aren't no, you, you're Rox? just sucking up, because you know I'm mad at you. Yeah. She's right. So cute. Anyway, so we've had this pure protein bar. Um, we do snack a lot on protein bars. We do we one a day. Eat. One a day. We one put a day it down. Usually in between meals. Um, just keeps topped up. Um, some of them even have like little nifty additions to them, like caffeine and stuff. Um, so they're pretty, pretty, pretty useful. I wouldn't say you need to rely on. I definitely would say you don't need to rely on them. But when you have them, if you find them on a good deal or you find one you really like, it's you know even macros. I can have biscuits, but I'd rather have a protein bar. It helps me get my protein. Um, and this this is good because these only have four and a half fat. I think the problem with most protein bars is they're very high fat. Between it's six. Anyway, anyway, let's see the macros on it. It's four and a half fat. That's what's good with these. Most are like six or up to ten, somewhere between that, which is a little high, especially for, for women. Um, now, carbohydrate says seventeen, of which polyols four, so that's only thirteen. And oh no, there's a quarter of polyols you need to take in. So I, I usually 14. just put them in as 17. It's 14. And then you use and it as a protein. Protein 21. So 21, 14 active carbs, and 4.5 fat. Mm -hmm. Pretty good little snack room. And you can actually dip them in, um, in coffee. I found that out and they still stay. And look, I've got Home and Away on in the background. Oh, gosh, I hate soaps. I love Home and Away. <coughs> that and Big Rich Texas. Oh, I love sneezing here. Okay. Oh. Done. Cut. Cut, Lex.